Whoa, she has a hundred lives. I wish I had a hundred lives. I'd have so much fun. Hey, Brianna, do you want to come jump off buildings with us later? No, I'm super busy. I'll pass today. Thank you, though. Come on, you have so many lives, you should use them. She has so many lives, and she doesn't even use them. That's so boring. If I had that many lives, I would not be like her. Did you want to come drowning with us? Not today. Sorry. Are you sure? It's going to be so much fun. I'm sure. Hello? Honey, come quick. We were in a terrible accident. Your sister's in critical condition. She's not going to make it. She'll need at least 99 lives to survive. But honey, you only have one life left. And that's all I need. Just do it. Hey, you're awake. Yes, sissy. I feel so much better. Uh, where'd your lives go? You have to cover up your one life, or people will see you as a target. A target? Yes. They see people with one life as weak and want to eliminate them all. Why'd you cover up your lives? I was just sick of everyone bringing up how many lives I have. I just thought covering them up would be easier. You know, most people that cover up their lives only cover it up because they only have one life and they're scared. Last time you saw me, I had a hundred lives. How would I lose lives that fast? You know I never use them. Hey man, we should wipe that makeup right from our forehead and see how many lives she truly has. Good idea. It's against the law to cover up your lives anyways, and we don't want any one-lifers hanging around here. Whoa, Brianna, are you okay? Yeah, it's just, it's just really hot in here. Brianna, you only have one life left? I knew it. Let's get her! <laughs> how many words did you get this year? Zero? That's even less than last year. It's okay, baby. Don't be upset. How about I take you shopping? It will cheer you up. You like that dress? Alright, let's go buy it then. Oh, you want to try it on first? Alright, let's go. I'm very sorry, sir, but it's only one person per change room. No, I have to come with her. She's going to need help with the zipper. Don't worry, sir. I'll be there to help her with that. Please wait here. Oh, it looks like you got the zipper just fine on your own. Help me. Help you, I... Do you know that man? Here, I'll donate some words to you. I contacted the police. They're already on their way. You tell them everything when they get here, okay? Wait right here. I'll be right back. What did I hear about the police? Let's go. We're going home. How could you do that to me? You're trying to leave me? That's it. No food for a week. I'm so sorry I had to take away your food, baby. You know I love you, but you trying to run away really broke my heart. Really? Is that how it is? No water today. Listen to me, baby. If you apologize, I'll give you your water privileges back. Police, open up! I'm in here! Please choose the nice outfit. Are you kidding me? It's picture day! Alright, Brianna, come up. You're next. No. Get ready to smile for your picture in three, two... One. Are you ready for the test? Of course. I literally studied all night long. You better let me write this test. Jerk. Miss, I have to leave. I can't write my test. I'm sorry. Why did you leave during the test? You said you were prepared. This is so humiliating. <laughs> Jake, why are you laughing so much? I just made my soulmate have the worst day of her life. Really? Yeah, I ruined her picture day, made her miss her test, and then I absolutely humiliated her. Whoa, you look scary. You. Today it's my turn to make the choices. Revenge is gonna be sweet. Oh, would you look at that? Looks like someone's missing basketball practice. You're the worst. You knew I had basketball practice. And you knew I had picture day. No, 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 please. I have to go to that class. I'm so close to failing. Yeah, and I really needed to write the test yesterday, too, so... Here, I bought you some cookies. Aw, you're bribing me. Uh, no, I'm just a nice guy. Well, you're lucky. Unlike you, I'm actually a good person. Woo, you can do this, Jake! Woo, we won! I know! The other team, they didn't stand a single chance against you guys. Thanks for letting me play. I hope you can forgive me for being such a jerk. Oh, this is gonna be easy.
Good morning, Mom. Good morning, sweetheart. Here, I made you lunch. You always know just how to brighten someone's day. <laughs> hey, Mrs. K, that necklace looks absolutely stunning on you. Really? It does? My bully? No way! She doesn't deserve it! What are you wearing? <laughs> I know, it's so funny, right? I mean, like, what am I wearing? What am I wearing? You're acting strange. Hey, wanna know something so crazy? I've never actually seen you smile. Why don't you show me those pearly whites? <laughs> okay! Hey, so I'm actually doing a survey for a class. I just need you to write down all the things that make you happy. I know what you're doing. You're trying to make me smile. It's not gonna work. I haven't smiled one day in my entire life. There has to be something that makes you smile. No, nothing. All I see is darkness and the world crumbling around me. That's dark. I know, let's go to that garden you like so much. You know, the one with all the decaying flowers? Yes, that place is nice. It stinks here. That would be all the rotting plants. This place makes you happy? Yes, I like it. The decaying flowers is like a metaphor for my life. Then why aren't you smiling? I'm so glad to be out of there. I can finally breathe again. Hey, has anyone ever told you how pretty you are? Flattery will get you nowhere. What am I going to do? If I can't make you smile by the end of the week, my life is over. Okay, I'll smile if it means you're going to leave me alone. Yes, please. No, that's not a smile. Yes, it is. That's creepy. It's okay. I won't give up. Come with me. You're going to smile. I found a list of jokes on the internet, and I'm going to recite them to you until you smile. Why couldn't the pony sing a lullaby? Because he was a little horse. You have the humor of a brick wall. Once you see how pretty you look in this makeup, you are going to smile for sure. Don't put pink stuff on me. Okay, you're done then. Look in the mirror. Ah, what did you do to my face? Put this on, it's totally gonna go with your makeup. No. What, why? You don't like this sweater? It's literally my favorite one. I'm not interested in any of these things. You're only doing the things you like, and I'm nothing like you. You just like basically everything. I don't know what to do anymore. I give up. You're never gonna smile. Oh! <laughs> you just ran into the door. Good morning, I made you lunch. Thank you, mother. Have a good day at school. Thank you. Hello, best friend. Hello. Watch out for the... Ow! Table. No, no, please don't do this. I just hit my arm. I'm so sorry. Where is Emily? You always walk together. She is gone. Hey, I, uh, I heard what happened to Emily. I really hope you're doing okay. Be careful. You're showing emotion. Actually, I figured out how to show emotion without getting caught. I can show you how to do it if you want. How do you show emotion without getting caught? The trick is to stop caring. You wasted my time. Try it out and see for yourself. <laughs> Mother, don't cry. You'll get caught. Your little sister Ella's gone. She threw a tantrum at school and now she's gone forever. Mother, I love you. Hey, what you said worked. I stopped caring after everyone in my life was gone. I knew you'd come around. We need to put an end to this wall. Can you help me? <gasps> did you just get an emoji? I did. My soulmate's a brunette. He's just my type. Really? Mine's blonde. My soulmate loves reading. He's just like me. I'm so excited to meet him one day. Oh, I just got a car emoji. Maybe he drives? An ambulance? Hey, do you know what ambulance might mean? I don't know. Maybe he's going to be a paramedic when he's older? Yeah, I'm sure it's that. Oh, no. You got a skull emoji? Does that mean your soulmate is... No. 
No, there's no way. It can't be. It's not fair. Brianna, wait. Where are you going? I'm going home. I just got a call. Oh, no. And a police car? I wonder what the police car could mean. I just got another one. It's a man running. Hmm. A police car and a man running. He looks like he's hiding or something. Oh, my. Brianna. I don't think your soulmate's dead. I think he's a murderer. Okay, make a wish. How many years did you get? Eight. But you'll only be 17. Don't worry. I'm sure she'll find a nice, handsome prince to marry. I hope so. Your birthday soon. Have you chose a prince you'd like to marry? No. All the princes I met so far are just Hello, princess. I heard you're looking for a prince to marry. How about me? I'd rather drop dead. <laughs> well, that's what's going to happen. I heard Prince William likes you. Yeah, but he's not my type. You don't have much time left. Maybe you can learn to love him. You are to marry Prince William. Final decision. But mother, I don't like him. Enough. You don't have enough time left. You must marry a prince in two days. Who said I even like princes at all? Excuse me? What if I like a princess? Two princesses marrying is forbidden. Mother. That's enough. I'm going to start making the arrangements for you to marry Prince William. Brianna, are you okay? I am to marry Prince William tomorrow. I'm sorry. I know that he wasn't your first choice. No, he wasn't. I now pronounce you, Prince William, and you, Princess Brianna, to be wedded. I object. Ella! This is absolutely preposterous. What kind of objection would you have to our marriage? I object because I want to marry her, and I know that she feels the same way. Ugh, that's absolutely rancid. Two princesses cannot marry. They won't accept our marriage. I know. How about we elope? One? How? Well, at least he's popular. Honey, are you alright? Yeah, I'm okay. Okay, just checking. I love you. I love you too, Mom. I know it's been hard, but try to have a good day, okay? I will. Guys, it's about to be midnight. I'm so nervous to see how many smiles I got. It'll be a lot. You're the happiest person I know. I hope so. Oh, wait, it's happening right now. I have a thousand. What about you? One. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's okay. I just won't smile. Are you sure? I've never seen you sad. Hey, Bailey. Hey, guys. Um, whoa, what is wrong with you? I only got one smile. Oh, that sucks. I have 4,000. Wait, does that mean you can't smile, like, at all? No, only the one time. Ew, we can't hang out with you. Come on, guys, let's go. Uh, I'm sorry, I have to follow them. Don't listen to them. They're assholes. It's not your fault. They were my only friends. I'll be your only friend instead, then. Also, I might have a way of helping you out. Why you gotta be so mean? You need to stay away from my boyfriend. He's coming over and I know that you like him. Maybe we got lost in translation? Don't pretend like you don't know. I saw you flirting with him. It must be exhausting always rooting for the anti-hero. Oh, hey Bailey, uh, I like your outfit today. Lately I've been dressing for revenge. I'm glad you're in a good mood. That made my day a little bit better. Everything will be all right if you keep me next to you. Wait, really? Uh, that's really sweet of you. You belong with me. To be honest, I'm in love with you, not your sister. I used her to get here. Boys only want love if it's torture. I knew it. I knew you were trying to steal my boyfriend this whole time. There's nothing I do better than revenge. How could you do this to me? You're my sister. Don't blame me. Love made me crazy. There is something seriously wrong with you, and you were done. It's me. Hi, I'm the problem. It's me. I know you guys tell me to stop messing with my hair, but my bangs need a trim. Am I gonna go to a stylist? No. I'm gonna cut them myself with my baby tiny scissors. I just wanna do some baby pieces in the front cause I don't trust myself, but I also can't see cause of the bangs. Okay, I'm just gonna say fuck it and start cutting. <laughs> I don't wanna mess them up. That's my biggest worry that they're just gonna like look really bad. I don't think that that's even. I think I need to cut a little bit more on this side. Hopefully I won't <laughs> regret this. Okay, I'm too scared and I barely took anything off, but I can definitely see now, which is good. I think that they're cute. My hair is always really messy, so you probably won't even tell if they're kind of uneven. 
Okay guys, I just got back from the festival day two and my hair is looking a little crazy, but the makeup has stayed on for the entire duration of the festival because of this NYX Cosmetics mattifying setting spray. It is so impressive and look at these stars. The dating standards in 2023 are literally on the floor. Like when did a date become getting in a car and just sitting in the parking lot? I just want someone to serenade me. Is that too much to ask? If you agree that romance is dead, then you're gonna like this song. I keep dating. No, honey, I'll walk you. Okay. Hey, Mom, can I go to the mall with Jessica? Her mom's taking us. You can go, but I'm driving you. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Hey, Mom, there's this school trip. Can I go? How long is the drive? About three hours. No, sorry, you can't go. Okay. Hey, Mom, I'm finally 16. Can I please learn how to drive? No. But both my sisters got to learn at my age. I said no. This is not fair. Hey, girl, are you coming with us to Jackson's party tonight? I would love to, but I can't. Ugh, is this about the whole driving thing? I'll take you. I have my license. You know what? Yeah. Pick me up at 7. I'll follow you into a park Through the jungle to the dark Girl, I've never loved one like you Boats and boats and waterfalls Alleyways and payphone calls I've been everywhere with you That's true We laugh until we think we'll die Barefoot on a summer night Nothing new is sweeter than it with you And in the streets you run free Like it's only you and me Jeez, you're something to see Oh, honey, let me come home Home is wherever I'm with you Oh, honey, let me come home Say yes. Yes. Sweetie, does this dress make me look fat? Yes. You really think that? Yes. You're such a disappointment. Do you know that? Yes. Giselle, will you do today's homework for me? Yes. Really? I wasn't expecting you to say yes. Will you do the whole week's homework for me? Yes. Oh my gosh, thanks. You're the best. Yes. Class, today we're doing a pop quiz. Yes. Giselle, you seem really excited about the quiz. Yes. Should we throw in a surprise presentation too? She better say no. If she says yes, she's done. Yes. Hey, babe, I think we should break up. Yes. Wait, so you want to break up too? Yes. You're cheating on me, aren't you? Yes. You can only say no. No! Honey, do you want some breakfast? No! But it's your favorite, chocolate chip pancakes. No! Are you okay? Should I call a doctor? No. Giselle, did you finish the assignment? No. Are you planning to finish it? No! And you just earned yourself detention? No. That's it. Go to the principal's office. Giselle, do you have a day to prom yet? No. I heard Chad's gonna ask you. No! But I thought you were in love with Chad. <gasps> Giselle, he's coming! No, 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 no! Hey, Giselle. Will you go to prom with me? No. Is that a yes or a no? No! Whatever, I'm out of here. No. You should really be more careful. No, wait, I think you might be my soulmate. He drives a Ferrari with no license plates? Maybe he's not as innocent as I thought.
<sighs> Natalia, are you okay? What's wrong? No, nothing. I'm good. Really? You're gonna lie to me? Okay, guess I'll leave you alone. Fine, but you have to swear not to tell the boss. So your soulmate saved your life, and now you've gone soft and don't want to kill him. That's true, except for the going soft part. Well, now the boss is going to kill you. I know, this is why we can't tell him. You promised, remember? I know, I'm not the one that has the briefing with him tonight, though. <sighs> you eliminated him? Yes, sir, I did. That's a good girl. Did anyone see you? No, no one saw me. Very good, very good. Actually, I should be going now, so... Get back here. It's time to teach you a lesson about lying. It's time to teach you a lesson about lying. Oh, no, Natalia. Can I stay at your place tonight? I, I don't think I can make it back home. I can't believe he didn't kill you. Yeah, well, right now I'm kind of wishing that he did. He said I have one more chance to finish the job. I don't even know who he knew I was lying. Actually, I think I do. Because you told him? Oh. That is for thinking I would ever do that. Come on. Okay, then how did he know? I think your soulmate is the boss's son. What? You're sure you saw him in the boss's driveway? Yep, I took a picture of his car. This is him, right? Yeah, damn it, that's him. I don't understand this. If he's his son, then why does he want me to kill him? <sighs> I don't think they get along very well. Well, the boss gave me 24 hours to get rid of him, and if I don't, I'm dead. You ready? Yeah. I already killed my soulmate. Don't worry, it's not that bad. Natalia, do you see any sign of him? No, not yet. Wait. Scratch that, I think I see him. But he's too far. I need to get closer. Freeze. Hey, easy now. My dad put you up to this, didn't he? Yeah, I'm sorry, but I don't have a choice. Natalia, cook the shark. You know, you have really pretty eyes. Flattery isn't gonna work on me. Well, if you're gonna kill me, then do it. But you're wrong about not having a choice. What are you talking about? Listen, I'm willing to help you eliminate my father. This is your call. Do you trust this guy or not? You know what? Yeah, I do. Is it done? Yes, sir. Good. Now, where's the body? It's in the trunk. Show it to me. I want to see it. There you go. See for yourself. There's nothing here. Surprise. Hey, Dad. I can't believe you were going to have me kill your own son. This is a setup? Oh, Natalia. And to think you were my favorite. Have you forgotten about the chips in the back of your heads? So what? They're just trackers. No, Gretchen. They're a little more than that. If I die, so do you too. Fine. Then so be it. Because a life working for you isn't a life worth living. Natalia, wait. I have to. He's bluffing. I'm not. So be a good girl and quit that. That. Told you he was bluffing. You two scared the shit out of me. I'm sorry. Eh, it's okay. I'm just happy to be free. So, are we gonna address the elephant in the room? Are you referring to my kill count? Oh, that's right, he knows your number. Okay, come on, tell me. Look, I don't wanna say it, okay? Listen, I killed my soulmate for no reason. The only joy I will get is knowing your kill count. Uh, do you really want to deprive me of that joy? Fine, it's... 269. I couldn't hear you. Oh, come on, just say it. It's 269, okay? Oh, no, you need to change that number right now. Go, go kill a rat or something. I'm not gonna go kill a rat. That's not even how the body count works. Excuse me. I'm looking for a girl. You, come with me. No, thanks. I wasn't asking, sweetheart. Hey. Okay, not gonna lie, that was kind of hot. I got you, babe. There's more of them coming. Looks like I'm changing that number. It's done. This guy better be paying me double. Or, I can handle that. So, did you get your soulmate's number yet? Yeah, I did. It's four. How about yours? Oh, wow. Mine's 60. Oh, I'm so sorry. Eh, I mean, my number's more than that. I got this guy. You take that one. Copy that. Nice one. What the hell? Guess what? What? My soulmate's number just got bumped up to seven. So? 
So that means that he was having, you know, a threesome. It's not that kind of body count. It's not. Then what does the number represent? <sighs> it's our soulmate's kill count. So that means that he could see every time I... Yep. Oh, this is not good. You're overreacting. Do you know what my kill count is? No, because you won't tell me. Exactly, because it's really bad. Oh, please. Is it more than mine? Mm-hmm. Well, it's not like this guy is a saint. I know, but seven compared to my number is like nothing. <sighs> Hang on. It's the boss. So, what do you say? He wants us to take out our soulmates. Like, take them out on a date? Or like... <sighs> Eliminate them. Obviously the second one. You know we can't have attachments. Well, I'm not gonna do that, are you? Natalia, you know what our boss will do if we don't. I really don't want to kill him. Oh my god. Not you, you idiot. Natalia, we don't have a choice. Hey, can you hear me? I'm getting a lot of static on my... Let me see your hands. This is for killing all my men. Disappear and stay? What does this mean? It's a new form of population control. People can vote for you to disappear or stay. Why do you look worried? Well, Dad, because I haven't exactly been nice to people. Everyone's going to vote for me to disappear. Oh, honey, it's going to be okay. Just try to apologize. Looks like it's finally payback time for you making fun of me all these years. I understand. I'm sorry. Hey, Giselle, remember that time you cut my ponytail off? Jessica, that was in middle school. Can't we just forget about that? Actually, we can't. You never even said you're sorry. I'm sorry. Giselle? Jake, hi. Remember that time you cheated on me? Look, I told you I was sorry. If I could take it back, I would. Well, you can't, so... Hey, um, Giselle? Look, just vote for me to disappear already. I never really liked you, but... Hey, uh, Giselle? Look, just vote for me to disappear already. I never really liked you, but... You voted for me to stay. Why? You're always mean to me, but I don't think anyone deserves to disappear. Thank you. I promise I'll try to change. Guys, look at him. He's such a loser. Hey, leave him alone. Look who's talking. You're a big bully yourself. Yeah, well, I'm trying to change. <laughs> you could never change. Shit, I forgot my pen. Hey, you could borrow mine. Wait, really? Thank you. You're welcome. Mom, I'm home. Do you have your report card? Yeah, it's right here. Look at this. You got all D's. You're such a disappointment. You don't mean that. Oh, yes, I do. I think it'll be better for you to just disappear. Mom, please don't. You don't really leave me much of a choice. Mom, I'm home. Do you have your report card? Yeah, it's right here. Look at this. You got all D's. You're such a disappointment. You don't mean that. Oh, yes, I do. And I think it'll be better if you just disappear. Mom, no, please don't. You don't really leave me much of a choice. What's going on here? Dad, Mom voted for me to disappear. Is this true? Yes, she's just a waste of space. You know what, Giselle, just come with me. Dad, what's going on? It's time I tell you the truth. She's not your real mom. Are you serious? Yes, I'm sorry. I never knew she would treat you like this. You lied to me my whole life. I only need one more vote to disappear, so I'm gonna go find someone to give me that. Hey, I know you hate me. Can you please just vote for me to disappear? Why would you want that? Look, just do it. Um, okay. Hey, I know you hate me. Can you please just vote for me to disappear? Why would you want that? Look, just do it. Um, okay. No, I said vote for me to disappear, not stay. But I did vote for you to disappear. What? You must be the one. The one? What do you mean the one? I can't tell you here. Come with me. Can we stop running and you just tell me what's going on? There's a rumor that there's a person that's unable to disappear no matter how many votes they get. And I think it's you. <laughs> me? Why would it be me? Because when I voted for you to disappear, it went to stay. People are going to come looking for you. You guys, there they are. They found us. We have to go. Okay, I think we're safe here. 
What are we gonna do? I haven't been completely honest with you. There isn't only one person unable to disappear. There's two, and I'm one of them. So you're one too? Yes, and here's what we need to do. Really, guys? You got me a paint set for my birthday? Sweetheart, that is a special paint set. This thing doesn't even come with a paintbrush. Press a color. Um, okay. What is 13 times 379? 4,927. Excuse me? Yeah, I believe that's the answer. 4,927. That's right. Oh, what? You didn't use a calculator. How did you... This power is making me super smart. Want to ditch class and go to the mall? Yeah, but the probability of us getting caught is like 80%. I'll take my chances, Einstein. Let's go to the American Girl store. Okay. Oh, look at the cute girl and her doll. Hey, kid, did you know that American Girl dolls were invented in 1986? I think I know more about American Girl yeah. than you do, You never get to any American Girl set. Pick a color. Mm, I think I'm going to pick red today. Oh, I'm going to fail this test. Hey, chill. Whoa. What? Are you by any chance wanting to become a doctor? How do you know that? Yeah, you know what? I just had this feeling, and uh, I would not sweat that test if I were you. You're going to be just fine. I heard you could see the future. Sorry, I really don't know what you're talking about. Actually, give me your hand. What did you say your name was? Adrian. Why? Well, you could have this back. And just, um, stay away from me. Please tell me my future. Fine, but you're the last one I'm doing today. No pomegranate. No pomegranate. No! No, 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 no pomegranate. What? What did you see? On Wednesdays, we wear pink. Sweetheart, Fluffy needs a bath. No way, that dog does not like me. Yes, she does. <coughs> see? You see? <coughs> Hold her. No, no, no. Oh. Why did you never do this to me before? Hey, Darren, I think you left your phone in class. Oh, jeez, thanks. I, I love you. What? Yeah, will you please be my girlfriend? Yes. I mean, yes. I think this power makes anyone I touch fall in love with me. Sweetheart, I brought the team over for dinner. Please shake everyone's hand. Introduce yourself. Oh, no, I don't think that's a good idea. Too stuck up to shake our hands? No, it's not that. I just... Uh -huh. That's rude, bruh. You know what? Fine. Nice to meet you. Why are you guys looking at me like that? Pick a color. Today, let's try yellow. Maria, is that you? Yeah, it's really me. I can't believe you're at our school. Well, that's a little odd considering, you know, I've gone here for four years. <laughs> you're so funny. Smile. This is going on my fan page. You have a fan page of me. Of course, basically everyone does. I think this power made me famous. Can you sign my backpack? Sure. Can you sign mine? No, I was waiting here for her first. No, I was here first. Please don't fight. You're making her uncomfortable. I am not. Being famous is way harder than I thought it would be. They won't leave me alone. I think I see her down there. They found me. Oh, I think I lost them. Hey. Hi. I want to be famous. Nah, trust me, kid. You don't. Being famous isn't all it's cracked up to be. Ah, no, there's there. Here. Prince Daniel, will you be my valentine? Sorry, princess, I can't. Why not? My mom says I have an arranged marriage to another princess. Prince William, are you ready for our Valentine's Day? <laughs> princess Elizabeth! Date. It's not what it looks like. Give me back my heart. I'm sorry. I didn't realize he was with you, princess. I'm just gonna go. Elizabeth, you only have one heart left, and if it breaks, something horrible will happen to you. No more dating. What? I'm sorry, but you don't have a good taste in men. I will be picking a husband for you. Elizabeth, meet your husband-to-be, Prince Darren. Hello. Mwah. She's beautiful. Give him your heart. I promise to take good care of it. Give him your heart. I promise to take good care of it. Mother, may I speak to you in private, please? Of course.
I'm not giving him my heart. Ugh, Elizabeth, why not? Because I was getting a really creepy vibe from him. Didn't you see the way that he was smirking at me? That's what men do when they like you. Mom, no they don't. You need someone to protect your heart, and that's what he's going to do. This is my last heart, and I'm not trusting that prince with it. If she doesn't believe me, then I have no choice but to run away. Excuse me. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to frighten you. I'm just a commoner. And you? You're the princess. I'm realizing now I probably shouldn't have left the palace with my crown on. I see her. She's down there. They found me. What's wrong? I need you to keep my heart safe. Princess, I couldn't. Please. Get her. Please take it. This is my last heart, and if it breaks... Something bad will happen to you. Someone's trying to break it. I will do my best to protect your heart, princess. Get her. Run. But what about... Run! Running away from the castle, are we? Come here. I found her, your majesty. Let go of me. Elizabeth. Where is your heart? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I mean I don't know, because I gave it to another man. What? What was his name? I'm not sure, Mother. I didn't ask. Could I have a moment with my fiancé alone? Of course, Your Highness. You can play all the games you want, Princess. I will marry you, and I will find the man who took your heart. Look all you want. You're not going to find him. We shall see. Prince Darren, we have found him. They were too fast, Princess. I'm sorry. Where is the princess's heart? Well, that's the thing, Prince Darren. You may have caught me, but you'll never find where I hid the princess's heart. How dare you hide my daughter's heart? My queen, I say we send him to the torture chamber. No. It's the only way to get him to talk. Mother, please. Elizabeth, Prince Darren is right. He still won't talk. We only got his name, William. Ugh. Mother, let me speak to him, please. He will tell me where my heart is. Oh my goodness, what have they done to you? I promised to keep your heart safe, and I don't break my promises. I can't let you suffer for me. But the prince that you're supposed to marry, I can tell. He is evil. I know, William. But that's my problem, not yours. Where's my heart? Finally, her heart is where it belongs. All right, Mother, Prince Darren has my heart. Now let William go. No, dear. I'm afraid I can't do that. William is going to be killed. William is going to be killed for stealing your heart and hiding it. It must be done. I told him to do it. Oh, Elizabeth, you're just trying to protect him, I know. It was such a tough decision, Princess. May I speak to her alone? Of course, Darren. Don't be so sad. Get away from me. <laughs> we shall be married tomorrow. I will never marry you. Oh, but you will. That is, if you want William to live. Marry me tomorrow, and I'll convince your mother to let him live. And if you try anything, I will break your last heart. Do you understand? Do you accept Prince Darren as your husband? I do. Excellent. Now may I kiss the bride. Stop! That prince is evil. William? He escaped? And he's lying. It's true, Mother. He's been threatening me. What? I warned you not to speak against no. me. Her heart! Why is nothing happening? Because it was my last heart, not yours. William! Stop! Stop the wedding. That prince is evil. William? He escaped? And he's lying. No, it's true, Mother. Prince Darren has been threatening me. I warned you not to speak against me. No! Her heart. Why is nothing happening? Because that was my last heart, oh, not yours. William, his last heart, it's broken. What happens when your last heart breaks? I'm pretty sure you... You die. <laughs> How could you? Mom, there has to be something that we can do for him. Elizabeth, I'm so sorry. This is all my fault. Just be happy that wasn't your heart. Arrest him. Get off of me. You should be arresting him. He took her real heart. My heart? I can give him my heart. William, where did you put my real heart? I... <sighs> William? Elizabeth? Don't speak to me. Darling, they found it. The gods found your heart. My heart, do you think it'll work if I give it to him? I'm not sure, dear, but it's worth a try. William, I want to give you my last heart. Please wake up. Yeah. Heart oh. share. <gasps> William. Elizabeth. <sighs> Why am I on a beach? I must have gone too hard last night if I don't even remember where I'm at. That guy over there is like not moving. I should probably check if he's okay. Hello, sir, are you okay? Dude, yo, 
Maybe he'll wake up if I slap him. <coughs> oh, that was a lot of water. Are you okay? You you just saved my life. Oh no, I was just walking by. Was that a mermaid? Forget about that. I'm in love with you. You've saved me. <gasps> I was not supposed to find you. What? What are you talking about? Nothing. You have to come meet my father. I can show him I finally found a wife. I'm sorry, a wife? I'm Prince Eric and I would love for you to be my princess. <laughs> I can't get married to you. What? You have to marry me. That's how the story goes. Oh, there you are. Good morning, dork. I am not a dork. Whatever you say. Hey, do you think my new haircut looks dumb? I don't like it. I think it looks really good. Right, you have to say that because you're my best friend. That's not true. You look great. Did you hear that we're getting a new student too? Yeah, we haven't had a new student in so long. <laughs> I know, I wonder who it's gonna be. Class, everyone meet Macy. Whoa, she's so pretty. Yeah, I, I guess so. Hey Macy, you should come over here. Take a seat next to us. Hi guys. Oh, my name's Jason and this is Bailey. Nice to meet you. You should come sit with us at lunch. Would that be okay? Yeah, for sure. Good morning. Uh, you didn't leave a seat open for me. Oh, my bad. I kind of forgot. I'll see you at lunch then. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Macy, what were you saying? Girl, you better tell him that you love him. I don't love him. Are you sure about that? You dropped this. Oh, thank you. I don't even own a TV. Whatever, I guess I'll just throw this away. What is this? I guess the only way to find out is to push one. Now I just have to figure out what that exactly caused. Why did all those people freeze at the exact same time? Does this pause time? Oh, I'm gonna get some good use out of this. Everyone, please put your phones away for the test. I forgot about the test. I know what to do. Just gonna steal the answer key real quick. Don't mind me, sorry. Play. You may now begin, you have one hour. Hey, uh, can I talk to you? What's up, babe? Yeah, so I'm sorry, but I have to break up with you. What? Mm, just one second. Hey, babe. Oh, uh, hey, what's up? I'm breaking up with you. What, are you serious? Yeah, bye. Everybody always told me to pick 80 years, but I wanna know what happens. Morning, Mom. Honey, why did you pick 10 hours? I don't want to lose you. You don't know for sure that's going to happen. I want to know. I'm going to school. Bye, Mom. Hi, Mr. Fitz. Giselle, you only have nine hours left. I just want to say it was a pleasure having you in my class. You were a great student. Uh, thank you. Oh, well, looks like somebody is dying tonight. How about you mind your own business for once, Jessica? At least I don't have to worry about bullying you anymore. Hey, um, do you know anything about the timer? You only have six hours left. You should have picked the 80 like everybody told you to. What if I'm really gonna die? What if I'm really gonna die? Okay, here it goes. Three, two, one. Wait, I'm not dead? Hey mom, look, I didn't die. Yes, honey, but there's a three on your face. What do you mean there's a three on my face? Here, look. I wonder what that means. Whatever, I'm going to school. Good morning, Mr. Fitz. Oh my gosh, Giselle, you're not dead. And there's yeah, a- I know. There's a three on my face. I don't know what it means either. Okay then, just take a seat. Okay. Well, well, well. Look who's alive after all. Jessica, don't start. I actually want to apologize for bullying you. Here, please take this. Thank you. I don't feel so... Hey mom, my nose is bleeding. Could you please pass me a tissue? Here you go, honey. Thank you. Mom, my blood. It's blue. It's blue? Get out of my house. But mom, I... No but. You're one of them. Hey girl, my mom just kicked me out. Can I please come crash at your place? Yeah, sure. Come right over. Thanks. Thanks so much for letting me stay here. What's wrong with your nose? Oh, it's just a nose bleed. Let me see. You freak. Leave immediately. You better stay away from me. 
what's happening? I have to get to the bottom of this. Hey, doctor. What seems to be the problem? My blood is blue. Do you know what's happening to me? You have to come with me. You're a... Hey, doctor. And what seems to be the problem? My blood is blue. Do you know what's happening to me? We have to go. You're a... I'm a what? It's not safe here. I'll tell you somewhere else. Come with me. Where are we going? And why is it getting worse? Because you're transforming. Transforming into what? Look, it's a blue blood. What do we do? Run as fast as you can. Don't worry, you're safe here. Where are we? How could you bring her here? It's not safe. Don't worry, she's one of us. What exactly am I? You're immortal. Wait, I'm immortal? Don't worry, you're safe here. Where are we? How could you bring her here? It's not safe. Don't worry, she's one of us. What exactly am I? You're immortal. Wait, I'm immortal? Yes. How's that even possible? I'll explain later. Come with me. First things first, cover up all the blue with this. Why do I have to cover it up? Because if you don't, people will come looking for you. What happens if they find us? They'll kill us. Now go do as I say. I covered it up. Good. Now go out and pretend as if you know nothing. Excuse me, miss. We're looking for the blue bloods. Have you seen one? I'm sorry. I don't know what you're talking about. Wait. Your nose. Stay right where you are. Don't try to run. Daddy, what is that? That's your likeness score. From now on, every time someone likes you, your score will go up. And when you reach 100%, you get to meet your soulmate. Wow. Snow, meet my new wife. Hi. Oh, hello. Daddy, I thought you said when people like me, my score will go up, not down. I don't think she likes me. Of course I do. There just must be a glitch. <sighs> the king's passing was so unexpected. Princess, I brought you a rose for your loss. Thank you. It's lovely. Where is my rose? It was a loss for me as well. He was my husband. I'm so sorry. I was just thinking of the princess, your majesty. Snow? Yes? I just noticed your percentage has been going up a lot lately. And father said that when I reach 100%, I'll be able to meet my soulmate. Hmm, no. That won't happen. Why? Because, dear, it's not meant to be for you. In fact, follow me. Let me show you something. Here, you need to see this. A book? It's a magic book. Now open it and see why you can't meet your soulmate. Read the words, magic book in my hand. Who is the most liked royal in all the land? The queen is the most liked. Her score is 80%. You see, dear, as queen I have a reputation to uphold. It was very hard for me to get to 80%, and I can't have you surpass me. But why can't we both reach 100%? No, it's either me or no one. From now on, you will no longer be allowed to leave this castle. But I promised the village kids that I would bring them toys today. So your likeness score can go up? I don't think so. I'm not going to break my promise. Thank you. And one for you. Thank you, princess. Wow, that was very kind of you, princess. Are those your guards? There she is. Get her. You have left the castle without permission, princess. I'm sorry. The queen orders you back now. Uh, don't hold her like that. Wait. My queen, we have found her. You directly disobeyed me. I'm sorry, I... Silence. Look at your score. I didn't mean for that to happen. Your percentage is higher than mine. Shall I still take her into the woods, my queen? Yes, and make sure she doesn't return. Mm. I'll make it quick. No, please. Quiet. Don't make this harder than it needs to be. Think about my father. What would he want you to do? The king would be so disappointed in me. I can't kill you, princess. You must leave here and never come back. But... Run, now! <sighs> Shoo! Get out of here! Why are you out in these woods alone? It's a long story, but my blouse, it's stuck in the vines. Don't worry, my dear. I will set you free. Come with me. It's not safe here. Son! Dad, where were... you? I just found this girl. Dad, this is the princess. Are you okay? Yes, but the queen, she's trying to have me killed. Why? I can't believe this is all because she's jealous of you. You can stay here with us as long as you need, princess. Our cabin is safe. Thank you so much. Of course. Here's an extra pillow in case you need it tonight. Thank you. 
I don't think I caught your name. Right. How rude of me. My name is Zachary, Princess. Well, I appreciate your help, Zachary. <laughs> Good morning, my dear. My son and I are off to go hunting. We'll be gone for a few hours. While we're gone, do not open that door to anyone. I promise, I won't. How did you get in here? Go. Be free. I guess the likeness score works on animals, too. Now that I'm at 100%, I get to meet my soulmate. That must be him. Now that I reached 100%, that has to be my soulmate. <gasps> Who are you? Oh, hello, my dear. I hope I didn't scare you. Actually, I'm not supposed to have strangers- But wait! I'm here to give you your soulmate. In that case, come inside. I brought this for you. An apple? Yes, you must be hungry. I don't like apples. But dear, I sense you're very lonely ever since your parents passed away. How do you know that? Because I'm magic. Isn't that how you feel? Yes, I, I've been so lonely. This is why I'm here, to help you, dear. One bite of this apple will make your soulmate appear. Do you promise? Cross my heart. You'll never be lonely again. Isn't it just delicious? You're so gullible. <laughs> Princess, we're home. No, this is my fault, Dad. Son, it is. I should have never left her alone. You'll be a queen in heaven. Goodbye, Snow. Soulmate found. Zachary? Princess, you're... You're alive. True love's kiss. I, I can't believe it. I can't believe what the Queen did. This has gone too far, my dear. You must take back your kingdom. You're right. Who is the most liked royal in all the land? Princess Snow is the most liked. That's impossible. She's dead. Think again. Stepmother, you're under arrest. Guards, take her away. Get off of me! I'll be taking this. No! That belongs to me! That crown belongs to Snow now. And I gotta say, it really suits her. One? How can well, you at least he's popular. Honey, are you alright? Yeah, I'm okay. Okay, just checking. I love you. I love you too, Mom. I know it's been hard, but try to have a good day, okay? I will. Guys, it's about to be midnight! I'm so nervous to see how many smiles I got. It'll be a lot. You're the happiest person I know. I hope so. Oh, wait! It's happening right now! I have a thousand. What about you? One. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's okay. I just won't smile. Are you sure? I've never seen you sad. Hey, Bailey! Hey, guys. Um, whoa, what is wrong with you? I only got one smile. Oh, that sucks. I have 4,000. Wait, does that mean you can't smile, like, at all? No, only the one time. Ew, we can't hang out with you. Come on, guys, let's go. But, uh, I'm sorry, I have to follow them. Don't listen to them. They're assholes. It's not your fault. They were my only friend. I'll be your only friend instead, then. Also, I might have a way of helping you out. Why you gotta be so mean? You need to stay away from my boyfriend. He's coming over, and I know that you like him. Maybe we got lost in translation? Don't pretend like you don't know. I saw you flirting with him. It must be exhausting always rooting for the anti-hero. Oh, hey, Bailey. Uh, I like your outfit today. Lately, I've been dressing for revenge. I'm glad you're in a good mood. That made my day a little bit better. Everything will be all right if you keep me next to you. Wait, really? Uh, that's really sweet of you. You belong with me. To be honest, I'm in love with you, not your sister. I used her to get here. Boys only want love if it's torture. I knew it! I knew you were trying to steal my boyfriend this whole time! There's nothing I do better than revenge. How could you do this to me? You're my sister! Don't blame me. Love made me crazy. There is something seriously wrong with you, and you were done. It's me. Hi, I'm the problem. It's me. I was wondering if you guys have Christmas specials. No, we do not have any Christmas specials. Sorry. Wait, are you that guy from yesterday? I'm super late. I have to go. Goodbye. I hate people around the holidays. <laughs> me too. Dude, there's another gift for you, but you're going to need two hands for this. A guitar? Holy shit. I need to find out who's been giving me these, and I know that guy has something to do with it. He left. What are you gonna do? Chase him down? That's a good idea. Sir, wait. 
Uh, yes. Who are you and why have you been giving me presents? It's not me, but I do know someone who can help you. Take this number and call them. Why would I call this random phone number? Where did he go? I have nothing else to do. Hello? Hello? Who, who is this? Uh, do you like any car insurance? Salespeople again? Bye. No, wait. You should really be more careful. No, wait. I think you might be my soulmate. He drives a Ferrari with no license plates? Maybe he's not as innocent as I thought. <sighs> Natalia, are you okay? What's wrong? No, nothing. I'm good. Really? You're gonna lie to me? Okay, guess I'll leave you alone. Fine, but you have to swear not to tell the boss. So your soulmate saved your life and now you've gone soft and don't want to kill him. That's true, except for the going soft part. Well, now the boss is going to kill you. I know, this is why we can't tell him. You promised, remember? I know. I'm not the one that has the briefing with him tonight, though. <sighs> you eliminated him? Yes, sir, I did. That's a good girl. Did anyone see you? No, no one saw me. Very good. Very good. Actually, I should be going now, so... Get back here. It's time to teach you a lesson about lying. It's time to teach you a lesson about lying. Oh no, Natalia. Can I stay at your place tonight? I... I don't think I can make it back home. I can't believe he didn't kill you. Yeah, well, right now I'm kind of wishing that he did. He said I have one more chance to finish the job. I don't even know who he knew I was lying. Actually, I think I do. Because you told him? Oh. That is for thinking I would ever do that. Come on. Okay, then how did he know? I think your soulmate is the boss's son. What? You're sure you saw him in the boss's driveway? Yep, I took a picture of his car. This is him, right? Yeah, damn it, that's him. I don't understand this. If he's his son, then why does he want me to kill him? I don't think they get along very well. Well, the boss gave me 24 hours to get rid of him, and if I don't, I'm dead. You ready? Yeah. I already killed my soulmate. Don't worry, it's not that bad. Natalia, do you see any sound of him? No, not yet. Wait. Scratch that, I think I see him. But he's too far. I need to get closer. Freeze. Hey, easy now. My dad put you up to this, didn't he? Yeah, I'm sorry, but I don't have a choice. Natalia, took the shark. You know, you have really pretty eyes. Flattery isn't going to work on me. Well, if you're going to kill me, then do it. But you're wrong about not having a choice. What are you talking about? Listen, I'm willing to help you eliminate my father. This is your call. Do you trust this guy or not? You know what? Yeah, I do. Is it done? Yes, sir. Good. Now, where's the body? It's in the trunk. Show it to me. I want to see it. There you go. See for yourself. There's nothing here. Surprise. Hey, Dad. I can't believe you were going to have me kill your own son. This is a setup? Oh, Natalia. And to think you were my favorite. Have you forgotten about the chips in the back of your heads? So what? They're just trackers. No, Gretchen. They're a little more than that. If I die, so do you too. Fine. Then so be it. Because a life working for you isn't a life worth living. Natalia, wait. I have to. He's bluffing. I'm not. So be a good girl and put that... <laughs> that... <laughs> Told you he was bluffing. You two scared the shit out of me. I'm sorry. Eh, it's okay. I'm just happy to be free. So, are we gonna address the elephant in the room? Are you referring to my kill count? Oh, that's right. He knows your number. Okay, come on, tell me. Look, I don't want to say it, okay? Listen, I killed my soulmate for no reason. The only joy I will get is knowing your kill count. Uh... Do you really want to deprive me of that joy? Fine, it's... 269. I couldn't hear you. Oh, come on, just say it. It's 269, okay? Oh, no. You need to change that number right now. Go, go kill a rat or something. I'm not gonna go kill a rat. That's not even how the body count works. Excuse me. I'm looking for a girl. You, come with me. No, thanks. I wasn't asking, sweetheart. Hey. Okay, not gonna lie, that was kind of hot. I got you, babe. There's more of them coming. Looks like I'm changing that number. It's 
done. This guy better be paying me double. Or I can handle that. So, did you get your soulmate's number yet? Yeah, I did. It's four. How about yours? Oh, wow. Mine's 60. Oh, I'm so sorry. Eh, I mean, my number's more than that. I got this guy. You take that one. Copy that. Nice one. What the hell? Guess what? What? My soulmate's number just got bumped up to seven. So? So, that means that he was having, you know, a threesome. It's not that kind of body count. If not, then what does the number represent? <sighs> it's our soulmate's kill count. So that means that he could see every time I... Yep. Oh, this is not good. You're overreacting. Do you know what my kill count is? No, because you won't tell me. Exactly, because it's really bad. Oh, please. Is it more than mine? Mm-hmm. Well, it's not like this guy is a saint. I know, but seven compared to my number is like nothing. <sighs> Hang on, it's the boss. So, what do you say? He wants us to take out our soulmates. Like, take them out on a date or like... <sighs> Eliminate them. Obviously the second one. You know we can't have attachments. Well, I'm not gonna do that, are you? Natalia, you know what our boss will do if we don't. I really don't want to kill him. Oh my god. Not you, you idiot. Natalia, we don't have a choice. Hey, can you hear me? I'm getting a lot of static on my... Let me see your hands. This is for killing all my men. 